morning friends hello again i am miss kendra from learn and play montessori school and i am very happy to see you again how are you doing this morning wonderful oh my goodness that's fantastic i'm feeling pretty good too so let's get started and take a look at the calendar days of the week my friends how many days of the week do we have did you say seven you guys are excellent yes there are seven days in the week and let's sing our seven days of the week song can you show me seven fingers how about two over here five over here we got seven fingers do we have seven fingers can you help me count these fingers? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, we do. We've got seven fingers. Let's sing our seven days of the week song together. There are seven days. There are seven days. There are seven days in a week. There are seven days, there are seven days, there are seven days in a week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Hmm. Friends, what's today? Is it Monday again? No. What is it? Ah, Tuesday. Yes. Today is Tuesday. If today is Tuesday, what was yesterday? Yes. Yesterday was Monday. Today is Tuesday. What's tomorrow? Did you say Wednesday? Yes, tomorrow is Wednesday. And tomorrow will be the last time I see you on Facebook Live this week. Okay, because we are going to enjoy our Thanksgiving. Yeah? Are you going to spend time with your family on Thanksgiving? Me too. My own family. Uh-huh. That's wonderful. Today is Tuesday. And the date is the 24th. How about months of the year? How many months of the year do we have? 12. Yes, we have 12 months in the year. Let's take out all our fingers and sing our 12 months of the year song. Ready? There are 12 months. There are 12 months. There are 12 months in a year. There are 12 months. There are 12 months. There are 12 months in a year. January, February, March and April, May, June, July and August, September, October, November and December. These are the months of the year. Fill them with joy and with cheer. The months of the year. Awesome, friends. And what month are we in now? You said November? We're not missing anything today. Yes, friends, we are in the month of November. And the year is 2020. Let's say today's date together, friends. Today is Tuesday, November 24th, 2020. And I have a really good feeling it's going to be a very wonderful day. You feel the same way? Oh, you're tired? Well, then let's get our clapping hands out and we'll sing our ABCs together. Your hands are ready to clap? Okay. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, 
W, X, Y, and Z. Now we know our ABCs. Next time, won't you sing with me? Thank you, friends. I am excited to show you some more red cylinders. Do you remember those cylinders we, we used the other day? We're gonna take a new look at those today.
friends. This is very tall and it looks to be much bigger at the bottom. Very thin at the top. Fantastic. Thank you for doing these red cylinders with me, friends. Next, we need to clean these up and get ready for a song. So let's make sure to be very gentle and slow when we are cleaning up our materials. Alrighty, friends, just like yesterday, we're going to sing the thankful song. Are you ready? You are? Okay, fantastic. One, two, three. I am thankful for you. I am thankful for me. I am thankful for my friends and family. And I think to myself, what am I thankful for? I'm thankful for food. I'm thankful for my home. I am thankful for each day that I learn and play. And I think to myself, what am I thankful for? I see people helping people. And I watch them care. They'll learn so much more when they are kind and they share. And I think to myself, what am I thankful for? Yes, I think to myself, what a wonderful world. You know what, friends? I do think to myself, what am I thankful for? And we do live in a wonderful world, right? We have our family and our friends. And even though we are not going outside so much right now, we are still enjoying a lot of things to be thankful for like our Facebook Live and we get to sing and dance together. We get to eat delicious food in our homes. 
We get to see mummies and daddies all the time. And I'm very thankful for all of those things. And something else I'm thankful for is learning. Learning with you and growing our skills together. What skills do you have, friends? Uh-huh, yes. You're practicing in numbers and letters. What about cutting skills? Are you grateful for your growing cutting skills? Me too. I love practicing my cutting skills with you. So let's do that now. At home, friends, you have this worksheet. What do you see on this worksheet? Yeah, that's some turkeys. You got that right. First thing we're going to do to practice our cutting, we are going to cut all the way around our big rectangle. And when we use our scissors, how do we hold? Our thumb goes in the small and two fingers in the big. We are ready to open and close. Okay, friends, we have our long rectangle. Now let's cut our turkeys into the basket. Friends, how many turkeys did we cut? Let's count these turkeys here. One, two, three, four, five. We have five turkeys. That's a lot of gobbles. Fantastic, friends. Let's clean this up and read a little story about some things we are thankful for. Oh. 
I am thankful for my family. Are you thankful for your family? Yeah, they're awesome, right? And I am thankful for my friends. I am so thankful for my friends. We have fun together and we learn together. Sometimes we see our friends in Zoom classes together. It's so fun. Because I miss my friends. I am thankful for school. I love learning and growing and I am so thankful for school. I am thankful for books. There are so many books in this world. Maybe there's a book about everything, anything. I am so thankful for books. I am thankful for animals. Animals are so cute and fun and a lot of other things too. I am thankful for parks. Parks are so much fun, especially when they're open. So friends, we always want to make sure to take care of the things that we're thankful for. Like family, we want to make sure to be thankful for our family and we're going to help take care of our family. Helping our family be happy and healthy, all those things. And we can also help care for our friends. When we are good friends and we are kind and we share, yes. our friends will be thankful for us too. And school. We are thankful for school and we can help our friends at school. So let's go ahead and I want to see what Books. Should we care for our books and treat them nicely? Can you put your mic on? Yeah. That's a way that we can show that we are thankful for books and animals. Do we show animals kindness? Yeah, and we're gentle with animals. And I think that we, they will be thankful for that. And parks. We also going to take care of our parks. We can keep them clean and not leave any trash. Our friends will be thankful for a clean park. Thank you, friends. So, last week, you had to dance with Miss Kendra. I know. And even though I'm thankful for dancing with my friends, I am also thankful for dancing with dancers. Like Miss Kendra. Erin, she's back today, friends. Let's say hello to Miss Erin. Hello, Miss Erin. Hi, Miss Kendra. Hello, friends. I'm so excited to be back dancing with you today. All so right, we so want to make sure we're standing up in a nice up. open space so we're not going to hit anything and hurt ourselves. And we are going to start by drawing some big circles with our head. Toss our head. Let's count to three. Ready? We have one. Two. And three. Let's circle the other way. Ready? Yes. One. Two. Three. And three. Good job. Now let's take our big letter T position and we're going to get our claw hands out, put them right on our shoulders, and do three big circles with our elbows. We have one. Yes. Three plus two. Three. Now let's go to the back. Ready? One. Three plus two. Two. Three. Good job. Let's go back to our big letter T position, and let's do three little circles to the front, drawing with our fingers. One. Two, three. Now let's make them big. One, two, three. 
All right. right. Let's go to the back of or back to our letter T position, and we're gonna do our circles to the back. We're gonna make them little. One, two, three. Now big. One, two, three. Good job. Shake them out. Get some wiggles out. All right. Now let's reach all the way up to the sky and the ceiling. We're up on our tippy toes, really stretching our arms up. And let's go all the way down. Can we touch our toes? Are you guys touching the ground? Making sure our knees are straight. And let's slowly roll up our back. And again, we're gonna reach all the way up. Reach, 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 as tall as you can get. And going down. And roll up slowly. Good job. Now I want us to take our hands and touch our elbows. Kind of like we're crossing our arms, but our hands are over our elbows. We're going to go back down and we're going to really relax our head. I want you guys to just swing side to side. Put our foot. Our knees are still straight. You yeah. can feel a stretch in the backs of our legs. All right. Good job. Let's go back to the middle and roll up very slowly. Now let's take three big right. breaths together. Ready, breathe in. And out. And breathe in. And out. Last time. And breathe in. And out. Very nice. Okay, so for our dance today, we're actually going to watch or listen to a video that Miss Kendra is going to be DJ for us for. And so hopefully you guys will be able to hear it and it's loud enough. And we're just gonna follow what the song says, okay? The song is called Turkey Time by Harry Kindergarten Music. And I want you guys to get your turkey wings out. Can everyone get your turkey wings out? All right, and then you can dance with your turkey wings however you want, okay? Here we go. before I'll have to practice later and my friends I will see you tomorrow have a great day bye bye